Hi, this is Tracy HD, and I want to thank you for joining me today for the Daily Angelic Message. As I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, angels, and God, please relay the message I need to share with my viewers the highest good of all. And today I'm using the Oracle of the Seven Energies by Colette Baron Reed. If you'd like to purchase these, click the link in the description box down below. And we're going to take the top card. Oops, the top card seems to be stuck there. Here we go. And the card is card number 47 for those of you that are following numerology. And this card is saying sacred reverence. Okay, and what a beautiful, beautiful energy emanating from this card. And this card is telling us, looking at the world, do you see all of life or only a limited part? When you look at a blade of grass, do you see just a plant? When you encounter a puppy, do you see just an animal? While this categorizing is one way of viewing the world, it is only a fraction of the truth. It isn't enough. Look closer and you'll observe the luminosity eminent in these living, sentient beings. If you allow yourself to take in all the world, include its spirit, then you see the whole. Reverence is an act of deep witnessing, respect, and awe. You experience it when you perceive every being and everything, every plant, rock, and tree as sacred and alive. You naturally lean into a state of bliss and harmony and a profound sense of well-being. To me, this is, you know, being in the moment and like just fully engrossing yourself in, in whatever you're focusing on and whatever you're doing. Whatever your dilemma or question, try to reframe your perspective to acknowledge the spiritual. It In, in everything, you know, there is something spiritual. Even the bad experiences that we have, it's always a learning experience. If everything has value, including your most frustrating challenges, would you still ask your question from the same place? Can you regard the other as sacred, thereby erasing the separation between you? Embracing the perfection of how you came together is real magic, and you are tapping into this unity right now. No matter who or what is in front of you, see that person or thing as luminous, and your interaction is holy. Then you will know what to do for the highest good of all. What a beautiful message today. If you've enjoyed this reading, please like it by giving it a thumbs up, share it, and above all, subscribe because I will be back with more.